to my channel so for once Harriet's actually wearing like a full face of makeup and she's actually dressed in something which isn't pajamas um I would say that this is the first time I've put makeup on for like five months um and my contouring is definitely not like how it used to be anyway at least I'm looking a little bit presentable than what I normally do I'm really sorry about the lighting but I just can't film off any natural light just because it's so cloudy and sunny at the same time. It just like keep messing up my camera. So I'm hoping that this lighting is going to be alright for you guys. But yes, I have a Zara haul for you guys and I'm really excited for this because I haven't done a Zara haul in ages. And I've picked up so many nice pieces. I will admit there's actually a few pieces, like maybe 8 more pieces that I actually have. But they've literally sold out because um, Zara's basically started their sale. Things on Zara, even full price, sell like out in like minutes, especially if they're like really popular. Um, and then especially when things go in the sale, they are gone. Like you have to grab them when you see them. So yeah, I'm only going to show you the things that are currently still in stock online. But I've got a feeling that the time I record this video and edit it, a lot of this stuff will be out of stock. But if you do download the Zara app, you can actually add things to like your favorite list and you can also like I think there's like an, a bit on the app where if something's out of stock you can get like email notifications so that when it does come available again you can obviously get a notification and you can quickly grab one but yeah anyway let's get on with this haul So this is the first item I want to show you and I saw this when it was first released like on Zara's website like in the new in section and I really liked it and um, this pretty much I think came out like a month or so after like the Louis Vuitton bag came out Are you? I don't need to describe but I think you kind of know which one I'm talking about but it's pretty similar kind of to this one like with all the different kind of like bags attached to one bag um, and yeah, Louis Vuitton is like thousands of pounds and this was only £50 and I say only but actually I think that's really really expensive and I was like I'm going to wait until it goes down in the sale just because I don't know I just couldn't justify spending like £50 on this bag when ugh, it's not even like a designer bag and I managed to grab one like when the sale started obviously went down to £30 and yeah this is what the bag looks like as you can see it's got three different separate kind of like bags this one here the main bit of the bag is like it's basically like a giant purse so you've got bits here like little slips um for like your card the thing about this is you can detach some of the bags obviously from the main bag but basically everything detaches from everything even like the main strap um, and then this is the actual strap. It's like a nylon strap. It's actually really sturdy. This is also adjustable. Um, and the only thing I don't like about it is, is that this is how big it is. If you want to actually know, it's not too bad. You can still get it round. I would probably, maybe prefer it to be just like a tad bit longer. Um, but anyway, I think if you'd rather spend £30 on one of these bags rather than like, you know, £1,000 then I think this is like a really good dupe for the Louis Vuitton one. The next bag I want to show you is this denim one. And yeah, this was $29.99. I really love this. I think this will go with so many different things, especially like really casual kind of outfits. They do this in a light denim wash, which is also £30. Um, yeah, I, I just really love it. I just think it's such like a really nice cool bag. Like how often do you see like a denim material bag? And then this is the strap. It isn't, you can't make it long, so it is just obviously a shoulder bag. And yeah, I don't know, I just really like it. It's just like a really nice quilted bag. This is the next item, and it's just basically like a black crop top, but it's like very cropped. But when I put it on, when I wear it with like high-waisted clothing, I quite like it. This was for $5.99 full price, but they're actually only $3.99 at the moment online. I got mine in size large. I could have maybe got a size medium, um, but I prefer it just to be like obviously a little bit more, I don't know, I guess it's because it's really elasticated. I'd prefer not to be too tight because I feel like it'll just dig in. But I don't know if you can see on camera, it's like this, I don't know what you'd call this material. It doesn't actually, oh, it's cotton, but it's like, 
a shiny cotton but yeah even full price at 5 dollars I think is a bargain but yeah they're only 3 dollars at the moment now I've got a couple of skirts and a skirt to show you so this is the skirt I actually picked this up in the sale when it's $15.99 it's now gone down to $9.99 and I have noticed this one goes in and out of stock I picked mine up in a size large and I think it fits perfect just because I think if I got a size medium it would just been too like tight um, and even though I have put some weight on and I want to lose it, I think even when I've lost the weight, it'll still fit really nice. I love skirts just because, I don't know, when I wear other skirts and they're kind of floaty like this, I always feel like it's going to blow up or I feel like I can't bend down and do things because if not, I'm just going to reveal too much. But yeah, it's basically, if you don't know what a skirt is, it's got a pair of shorts underneath um, and then obviously you got the skirt over it. So it looks like you're wearing a skirt but you've got the safety of like the shorts underneath and I just really like this colour, I don't know if you can see on camera but it's got yellow, blues, greens in and I just think yeah this will go with a lot of different clothes like different tops um, and yeah it even goes really nice with that black crop top the next skirt I'm going to show you, they've got loads of these online, they've literally always been in stock I grabbed this when it was in the sale for $15.99, I reckon it's probably going to go down to $9.99 soon and it's just a really nice kind of florally, florally skirt and it's got a little slit at the front the reason why I love these ones because I don't normally wear tight skirts and to be honest I don't really wear skirts at all but I find the tight skirts just emphasise my chub too much but because it's got these wrinkles I feel like it really hides it and I went for size large again just because I can kind of hike up a bit and I feel like it goes high waisted um, I really love the colours on this, I just think they're so pretty, like pinks and the lilac-y colours. And then the last skirt, I think I picked this up for $15.99 in the sale, but I do believe this has gone down to $9.99. This one's going in and out of stock and they did have like a matching crop top, but it's more like a bra kind of crop top, if that makes sense. And they're like $6.99 or $5.99 at the moment. But I just picked up the skirt just because the crop top, just my boobs would not fit in it. Um, and yeah, it's got a zip fastening at the back. Yet yeah, again, it's that kind of like ruchy material. So I feel like it kind of hides on my chub and it fits really nice. And when I put this on, I was actually really pleasantly surprised how it made me look really slim. Um, and yeah, I just love all the frilly detail. Um, and yeah, this one has a zip up back as well, if I didn't mention that, as well as the skirt. I think the skirt has a zip on the side. Um, and I just really like these. I wanted a couple of really nice little pretty skirts for summer. And also you could probably wear these in winter. I'm not sure about this one, but this one I reckon if you wore like black tights and some little boots, you could probably definitely wear this in like the winter. If you've been looking for the ultimate bodysuit, then you don't need to look no further because Zara's bodysuits are the best of bodysuits I've ever bought. And I've worn bodysuits ever since like I was basically got into fashion and this has definitely got to be one of my most favourite bodysuits ever. I have this in a black and beige, like a beigey kind of pinky colour. Um, I think at the moment in the sale they have an orange one and maybe like a leopard print one I think. Um, but the new colour they're doing at the moment is this really nice pastel blue colour so I had to pick that up because I think that would actually go really nice with that blue skirt. I think that would look so nice with that. These honestly are the most flattering kind of bodysuits ever. It doesn't matter what body shape you've got, like what size you are, honestly pick one of these up. I would say size down, so normally I'd probably go for large from Zara, but I picked up size medium. This is $12.99 and yeah, I could have maybe even got size small, but to be honest, I like them to be like maybe a tad a little bit too big. Um, I, I did buy the white one, but I returned that just because inside there's like an extra little bit of material which is really good so you don't have to wear a bra but I found with the white one you could kind of see it, it through it and I didn't really like that um, but yeah for $12.99 it's so affordable the material is so nice honestly if you've been looking for a bodysuit try out Zara's ones so another kind of fashion thing that's very on trend at the moment is shoulder pad tops or even dresses I've seen and even shirts now Zara now doing shoulder padded shirts 
um and oh, they're so expensive i think it's just because they're very on trend and they sell out quick so when i've seen them like on ebay and that people are just selling them for like ridiculous amount of money i have ordered before some from some other companies before like pretty little thing and that i just found the quality was just rubbish and then zara brought out their version for 12.99 so the colors that they're doing at the moment is white um, this kind of minky brown colour and a black. Um, like I said, these are $12.99. On Zara's app, it does have this like size guide and it says mine was size large and I was like, I know they're going to be quite oversized. So I got a size medium and they're actually still too big. So I picked up size small and they fit perfect. They're actually now brought out a white and a black version, but they're more cropped and then they've got elasticated around the band at the bottom. And they're only $7.99, so I actually have picked up a size small in that, um, in the white colour, just to wear with skirts, just so I don't have to, like, keep tucking it in. And, yeah, like I said, the material's really nice. It's not like that material is going to stretch or lose its shape. Um, and yet, yet again, for $12.99, I think it's so good. The next thing I picked up is actually out of stock, and I could not find it online anywhere. I wanted to show you it anyway, because I love it. Um, they only had size large left and I probably could have done with an extra small because these are so oversized and it's this really nice leopard and tiger print shirt um, I've rolled up the sleeves because it looks better rolled up but yeah you can see like how big and even large is so I'm going to probably wear this as like a dress with like a belt to cinch it in a bit or I might just wear it as like a kind of cover up if that makes sense i'm just thinking like some really nice black chunky sandals with some shorts a white little crop top and this i just think it will just look so cute but you might be able to grab one in your local zara store um and i just think it's really nice just nice silky material and i just think it's quite different than a normal kind of boring like plain shirt so i've got another oversized shirt this one kept going in and out of stock yet again online and i haven't seen it online for like a week or so when i've been searching through the sale stuff so i would say maybe head to your local zara because they might have some in stock but i still wanted to show you it because i just thought it was so nice i mean you never know it could come in stock again i picked this up in extra small um, and this was originally £30 and I got it for £15.99 and it's just an oversized shirt. Yet again, even on me, it has even like done up, has so much room. But I just really love the sleeves. Like I just think the little roughly embroidery like sleeves are so nice. Um, and yet again, I thought I could wear this as a dress like shirt with obviously an underslip underneath because it's very see-through. Or I could just wear it as like a little cover up. But I just thought it was such a nice shirt. Um, but as you can see, like from the back, I don't know if you can kind of tell, but they're very, very oversized. And normally in shirts, I have to size up one or two sizes just because my chest and my shoulders. But with this one, it fits perfect as a size extra small and it's still got that oversized look. Um, so yet again with these, I would say they are very, very oversized. So I probably could have even got away with a size small and it probably still would have been oversized. But I saw another YouTuber, I can't remember who that was yet again, but she tried, um, I think she got the white one and she tried on extra large and it looked really nice on her and she's like much more slimmer than me and it didn't look like she was getting drowned in it. So I thought I would just like order extra large as well. Actually, I would have probably preferred size large. Um, but like I said, I could have probably fitted in a size small. Um, and it's just these really nice denim shirts. They say denim shirts, but I, you could still wear it as a shirt. Honestly, it's that proper thick actual denim material. So you could definitely wear this as like an actual jacket. Because honestly, it's so thick during the winter maybe as a shirt. But because it's so thick during like the summer and that, I just definitely wear it as like a cover up like denim jacket. But they do the white colour and then they also do the like light washed one. And I thought I'd pick up both. I already have like a denim jacket, but I just thought this had like a different bit of a style than the one I've got like, you know, in my wardrobe because that is like an actual proper denim jacket. And then I've wanted a, like a white denim jacket for ages and they're really expensive. And I just thought, oh, well, this is only $15.99 in the sale. I think they were originally like... £30. Oh no, they were originally £25.99. And now the last item I want to show you is this zebra print kind of like dress. 
it's like a really nice silky material so this was originally i think 25.99 but i picked it up in the south for 9.99 i haven't seen this in stock for ages but i just have a feeling that they might come back in stock again um and i picked mine up in size large size medium did fit but i just wanted it to be slightly a bit oversized just because with these kind of dresses because it's kind of like short and i wanted to wear this casually as well i just felt like it would look so much more better if it's like slightly loose just because i felt like the length would be a little bit longer and i don't know if you saw when i was showing you this jacket earlier but I think it looks so cool with like an oversized like denim jacket and then some like Nike Air Force or some Converse. I think that would look so cute. I think this would just be nice for like a little summer outfit. Obviously when it's really hot you definitely probably wouldn't want to wear that. But because it's got like just thin straps sometimes I feel like I'm a bit naked when I wear things like this out casually. For a night out yeah but casually I feel like I need something to cover it. But yeah that's the end I think. Yes, that is the end of my Zara. The other items of clothing you can see on my rail is from ASOS and I'm going to be doing a haul on them items soon. I hope you enjoyed this haul. I'm going to try and link as much stuff as I can down below. If not, I'll try and find some like other alternatives that Zara are obviously doing at the moment. Um, and yeah, I can't wait to start signing these for you guys over on my Instagram. Um, if you don't follow me on Instagram, then definitely go. It's down in the corner. And if you haven't already, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any of my videos. And if you did really like this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. And yeah, I love you guys, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye. You see her walking down the boulevard. She got the posture of a superstar. She looks so fly in those Gucci slides. Yeah, yeah, I wonder where she hides under.